Hey, what's up, everybody? So I got some new information in regards to the George Floyd uh, murder. So it appears that the uh, Minneapolis police officer, Derek Chauvin, actually worked with uh, George Floyd at a Latin nightclub called El Nuevo uh, Rodeo. And uh, according to the former owner, uh, Maya Santa Maria, she said that their shifts uh, sometimes would overlap. And um, she said that it's, it's hard to say if they um, would have known each other because um, uh, Derek Chauvin worked outside, uh, I guess at the door and checking IDs and is a police cruiser. And uh, George Floyd was a bouncer inside the uh, nightclub. But um, with that being said, it's probably likely that they would have maybe recognized each other because, you know, if you work at a nightclub, usually before they open up, they probably have some sort of, um, you know, meeting or whatever, where you s could would probably familiarize yourself with the people that you're going to be working uh, amongst. And, um, you know, according to um, uh, this news article, uh, Derek Chauvin worked at this nightclub uh, as, you know, part-time security for 17 years while uh, George Floyd worked there for about a year and um, you know so their their paths might have crossed before this incident and um, some other information that came out from this uh, you know this uh, former nightclub owner she said that on nights where um, they would have like a hip-hop night which would attract um, you know a lot more African Americans uh, Derek Chauvin would, uh, you know, his tactics and his demeanor would change and he would be a lot, you know, more likely to pepper spray everyone when there might be, uh, you know, minor altercations that occur in the uh, club. And um, he was a lot more aggressive when um, the clientele of the night changed from uh, Latino to African Americans. And uh, you know, that's very telling because you know, that, that can tell us that, you know, this man is a racist or at the very least, he holds very negative uh, opinions towards African-Americans. And, um, you know, it's just another reason why he should have never been a police officer. I mean, if someone has 18 complaints at their job, I mean, normally after, let's say, two or three, uh, you know, complaints or, or citations or whatever, you usually get fired. I mean, he had 18 of them. And, um, you know, it's very unfortunate that uh, Mr. George Floyd had to lose his life because this person is, I mean, he's a psychopath. And, um, you know, if, and I'm also hearing people say that if he did know George Floyd or they can prove that in court, that it could potentially um, change the charges that are being brought against him from like uh, third degree uh, murder or manslaughter to second or first degree murder because if you know someone beforehand, it, it, they might be able to prove that this could have been some sort of premeditated uh, vendetta that he had against uh, Mr. George Floyd before his uh, unfortunate death. So I'm, I'm very inter interested in seeing what's gonna happen. Um, just tell me what you guys think in the comments below. And please be safe out there and have a nice day. Peace.